painting a picture with words, mastering descriptive language. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into an intriguing English expression, painting a picture. But don't worry, we're not talking about actual painting. Instead, we're exploring how this phrase is a powerful tool in English language learning, enabling you to master descriptive language and enhance your communication skills. Stay tuned to discover how you can use this expression to captivate your audience, whether in writing or speaking. At its core, painting a picture is a metaphorical expression used to describe the act of creating vivid imagery through words. When someone says they're painting a picture with their words, they mean they're describing something so clearly and detail-edly that the listener can easily visualize it. This technique is not just about the information conveyed but about evoking emotions and creating a sensory experience for the audience. Descriptive language serves as the paintbrush in our verbal or written canvases. It involves the use of adjectives, adverbs, similes, and metaphors to bring your narrative to life. For instance, instead of saying, the dog ran, you could paint a picture by saying, the energetic puppy sprinted across the lush, green lawn with joyful abandon. Notice how the second sentence creates a more dynamic and vivid image? To effectively paint a picture with words, incorporate these techniques. Show, don't tell. Instead of stating facts, show them through details. For example, rather than saying, she was sad, illustrate it. Tears streamed down her face as she stared blankly into the distance. Use sensory details. Engage all five senses. Describe what you see, hear, smell, taste, and touch. Employ figurative language. Metaphors and similes make comparisons that spark the imagination. Saying, his voice was as smooth as silk, paints a clearer picture than, he had a nice voice. Let's put theory into practice. Try to describe a simple scene, like a sunset, using the techniques we discussed. Start with a basic description, then add details, sensory elements, and figurative language to paint your picture. Remember, the goal is to allow your listeners or readers to visualize the scene as if they were there. Painting a picture with words is a fantastic way to enhance your English language skills, making your stories and descriptions more engaging and memorable. Like any other skill, it requires practice, but the effort is well worth it. We hope this video has inspired you to experiment with descriptive language and start painting your own vivid pictures with words. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in our next video. Remember, every word you choose is a brushstroke in your narrative canvas. Happy painting!